Hello. Is it? Hey, hey. hey you too. <laughs> I like it. I like it. You like it? Is it good? No, I, I like it. Excuse me. Oh my god. Come on, what on earth is that? Ketchup. That is horrific. Then you get some I think I might throw up. Ugh. Finally off to see three years. Two and a half hours late. Oh. Old Soviet buildings over there. There's people walking on water. <laughs> Typ <laughs> typical thing you see on the city. Typical German things. Walk the water. <laughs> when they get bored. When you get bored. Yeah. You know, I have a slight suspicion there might, might be a path in between oh, the. Uh, no, no, John. I have a slight are suspicion. You sure? I don't know. I could be guessing. wrong. I could be wrong. Yeah, you could be wrong. Oh. I was correct. Yeah, you were right. Oh my god. Wow. So essentially we get our own space to um, kind of set up our project, show people, do kind of presentations. So this is a place with gaps, I have a problem with that. Which wish you could probably get down because it's way too high. <laughs> And uh, Kama thinks it's way too guys, arrogant. Yeah, the other guys are. I mean, they can show off. Yeah, no one else is much, showing off as much. Yeah, yeah, and they have a lot of awesome stuff to show. This is true. This much is true. Much better than ours. So I think that this is should go like down here or something. So hands down, the main attraction to our booth at C3 was Space Hun's Wi-Fi satellite. Well, at least that's what he called it. Uh, it's not actually a satellite of any kind, it just kind of looks like one, like the solar panels on a satellite. But anyway, it's uh, inspired by his Deauther boards, I'll link those below if you don't know what they are. So it was made up of 14 ESP modules, one to monitor each channel of the 2.4GHz band, and it logs all data onto microSD cards on the back. We don't think it picked up everything, because we only logged, if I remember correctly, a few gigabytes of, um, of traffic which uh, was probably quite a bit more than that that went on. But nevertheless, it was pretty cool. We had like dozens of people crowd crowding around at points wanting to have a look at it. I'll link the project page below. I think it's on Hackaday or something like that. But yeah, definitely definitely worth a look. So yeah, cool stuff. So uh, wait, how's it, how's it gonna work physically? Okay, so you've got these and those kind of are meant to Put slot on, there, on. And then on the other side, another one. And here are the modules then. And then there's 14 to go all the way down there. Yeah. Nice. Side. And then uh, you've got a load of that, USB hubs there. Oh yeah, to power them. Power them. And we did have, we did have power banks. So those <laughs> kind of, uh, with cheap Chinese coffee, uh, they, started they just exploded. And yeah. they didn't explode. They didn't explode. And we're gonna save everything. Oh. Too many, too many crystals. Each for every module. Here's an old. Um, oh, an old power supply there. Power supply from computer, which which has five volts. So we are oh, fine. Perfect. We are fine. We, we, we get this working somehow. If it's too small, then we have could it be battery powered? So if it was battery powered, how much how much current would it draw? Um, they draw 100 around 110 milliamps each, each module. Okay, so. Um, um, but where they, they can peak up to 300 milliamps when they start up. Oh, okay, so it's quite a bit then. Yeah. Yeah, for 14 of them. I mean, it's just like for like a millisecond or something, but yeah. they, they can peak. Yeah. Uh, another plug. You know MacGyver? No. I want to let the internet know that Dean breaks all my boards. No, I only break the, 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 the broken board. It's a you only break the broken boards. <laughs> yeah, you broke a button off oh, and a resistor. Okay, no. You just <laughs> broke them more then. Yeah. Fair enough. I don't know why I cannot get it out. Yeah.
So this is pretty much the only DL4 board out there right now. Uh, it's, it's, it's running all software. It's not, not open software. Not it's open. It's very, very close. It's very dangerous. Very, very dangerous. close software. Look how quickly it's running. All the, uh, let's get this. Yeah. So, and here, uh, it, has, uh, it has an automatic uh, reboot because I have problem with uh, uh, with uh, RAM space, mm. and so I reboot after 100,000 uh, 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 channels. channels. No, 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 scans. Scans, okay. Um, this is, you can also put out <laughs> you can also put on flashlight or put on, on power LED or you can uh, yeah. uh, the first module of the uh, Wi-Fi satellite one of 14 one of 14 yeah more coming more coming <laughs> so Oh, we can. You can change the channel. It's pretty much done. Yeah, this this one. Okay, uh, I'll change them all. So they're all logging packets to their individual SD cards, micro SD cards, yes. right? Yes. So if you wanted to retrieve that, you'd have to get all fourteen micro SDs. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> So we're going around now, just having a look at random stuff, seeing what we can find. Um, hello, we're hello. gonna get lost. Hello, camera. Hi, YouTube. <laughs> Because yeah, uh, he left his at home. <laughs> no, no, it's because I need them for home. I mean, like. Oh, you need them for home. Yeah, I, I, I broke. Pinkies. Yeah, if I broke some of them, and I need new ones. You need new ones. Oh, yeah, okay. that's why I have two euros for buying one. <laughs> no. <laughs> this contraption here is for. Um, I don't know, but I really want to turn this. And what do you think of this? Uh, What's up, YouTube? Hey. Bitcoin and blockchain <laughs> meetup. No, not that one. I think that we've got some comments within us. thoughts on C3 so far? So far so good or? Are you filming? Yeah. So man, it's great. Good? But, I mean, great experience. Worth it. I mean, DEF CON can't even this good plan. Well, I mean, I can't... this is fully community driven. Yeah. yeah. DEF CON is, like, there are so many like companies behind yeah, it. Yeah, DEF CON so. is like you buy commercial. the... Commercial. Yeah, commercial, you buy the big thing. I mean, no one has to DEF CON of us, right? Hmm? No one was at DEF CON. No. no, none of us. Yeah, yeah. so, yeah. can't really... The only downside to this is that 20% um, of it is in German. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> this looks 3D printed. Wow. Is this Deep Space Nine? Dean. Dean is hacking the mainframe with PHP. PHP. We can okay. definitely see that because he's Guys, reading it's important the drinking water. Otherwise, you cannot hack. <laughs> Dean, can you show us the um, Hack OS? Oh, yeah. So, this is really cool. Um, it's a web based interface for like pen testing. So, it's like modular. So, you can like. Oh, shit. I'm going to see his password. <laughs> There it is. So, um, basically, you can manage the entire pie from an interface. And here we have like some general information we can turn on and off the interfaces. We can manage the. So, this is all the system information? No. Yeah. Okay. So, this is it. And here we have like. like yeah, it's general information about general everything. Information. Yeah. So, here we have like some config. This is actually not being used. Yeah, the, the first part because the Wi Fi client. So, essentially, it's like a ha um, hacking framework. Yeah. Really. That's runs yeah, it's on a hacking by, framework. Basically. And people can add their own modules, is that right? So yeah. It's, it's super easy making modules. That, that's the point, and and it can be used like in server mode, like on a like portable mode. 
where you have like um, just the, your Pi with you and you install it somewhere and you just access it so you have like a direct access to the tool and then you have some like kind of um, modules that can be executed like actually there is only one module that is um, Mayo's proof it's one. It's still in development, but it's in late stages of development. Yeah, it's, 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 it's going to be released like some somewhere like maybe <laughs> okay, maybe, maybe maybe next year <laughs> it sounds similar to yeah. Wi-Fi yeah but open source documented uh, modular i mean like wi-fi pineapple software is also modular but it's like i want it i want i want this to be like super easy making a module it's like oh yeah you know awesome. great stuff and the, the thing is that then it, this one can be also operated like in a server mode like you have a botnet with all these connected to the same server so you control all of them at the same time. Nice. <laughs> Can't wait till it's released and I'm sure we'll do a video on it at some point when it comes out. Yeah, sniffed it. So um, all back at the house and I believe uh, Dean is cooking dinner. He's cooking what? Burritos? Burritos. How's it going, Dean? Be careful, be careful. Hey! Don't step in because of the glass. Don't step in, don't step in. What did you break? I, I you broke the, the bottle. I broke oh. the... <laughs> <laughs> I, I like, just happened to walk in when everything's falling apart. <laughs> well, all right, yeah, it looks, it looks delicious. I'm sure. I mean, yeah. onions and... Uh, you know. Okay, are we getting... No cameras here, no cameras! We're getting kicked out. No, bye, Dean! Bye, bye, bitches. Oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? I started the thing. <laughs> <laughs> should keep it a bit open so we can see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Space Sun has a Discord server. If you want to join it, you should join Satopia first and then we'll give you the link. Yeah. Uh, it's Discord. Oh, link. look! Three people joined since hey. I tweeted like a minute ago. So it's discord.gg forward slash Satopia and then just ask for link to Space Sun server and you can get it. Apparently, it's a thing in Germany that you uh, take bottles to the supermarket and you put it in a crusher and it gives you like 25 cents. So, uh, Space Hunt's been going around the convention just picking up everyone's water bottles. Yeah, because I'm a homeless guy. <laughs> okay, so I just went to brush my teeth with this quote unquote toothpaste I bought is there, is there in a getting? supermarket in Germany. Oh, and it's half cream, half cream. It's what is it? It's it's super adhesive cream, and I, I tried to brush my teeth with it. It, it just it it, it it tasted absolutely horrible. It just started gluing up my teeth. I was like, oh, this this isn't right, is it? That's what it's for. That's what it's for, apparently. But uh, why did they put it in a toothpaste <laughs> box? I, I bought, they put it in a toothpaste dude, box. Why? I bought, I bought normal toothpaste. Why? Oh, you did. Where where? I got normal toothpaste there. Oh my god. Anyway.